we're out riding the Yana Trail, which is a trail out in the foothills outside of Anderson, California by the Coleman Fish Hatchery. Uh, there's quite a trail system out here. It goes on for miles and miles and miles, but we're just going to do a part of it today. First nice day we've had in a long time, so we decided we'd get out of the house and go riding. It's a pretty nice trail. It's level all out in through here. There's some ponds up there that we're going to go visit eventually. And down back that way is the Sacramento River, which we parked by. We've been housebound for a week, so this is our first outing. We're, we're ready to get away from the rain and the gloom. It's been pretty nasty all week, and now it's nice. So he's a happy camper. Patrick found a little pond on the side of the road here. It's just a little bitty thing, but it's pretty deep. But he's, he's fishing. He's hunting and fishing. And over there, I don't know if I can zoom in enough or not, but over there is Mount Lassen. There's quite a bit of snow on it. Oh. Okay, I think it's time we go on for further adventures. He's coming back to check on me because I stopped. It's all rocky and rough in here and I don't want to go very fast. We're following the river. And right there the trail's okay, but past that it's all rocks. So we're just taking our time. Except him, he went on ahead and he finally had to come back and see what I was doing. Patrick found a creek. He's been down there playing in the creek. I don't even know what creek that is. I'll have to look it up on the map when I get home. Sacramento River is just right over there. Before you get to that next ridge over there, there's a Sacramento River winding around, so the creek's almost there. Might be a good place to stop and take a rest. Let's see where our Garmin says where we are and how far we've gone. And it looks like we've gone 2.54 miles. So we'll probably go another mile and turn around and go back. I don't want to do the dog much over seven miles in a day. He's still recovering. Well, the trail took a little turn right here. And we're going to go down and cross that creek. And we're going to go up the other side. I think I'm going to walk the bike down this. I know Dave and Carol will ride it, but I think I'm going to walk it. I'm a chicken. Well, we finally got out of the Rocky Canyon, so we're out on kind of a flat. So I thought I'd do a little more filming if I can do this without dropping the camera. It's pretty in here. It's a lot nicer trail than it has been behind us. There's a trail marker right there. Well, this is where we're really going to stop. I said we are going to stop back there, but I decided to go on a little further because the ground was flat. But We're at 3.34 miles now. That's where we came from. It was all nice and flat, but that's where it's going. It's going to go into that canyon and up through all of the rocks and up in the canyon. And I just decided I'm going to go back. 
nobody knows where I am and I'm seven miles from the nearest person and I'm 70 years old, so it's probably not a very smart thing to do. So I'm gonna turn around and go back. Well, we're on the way home. Uh, the trail comes kind of close to the river here, so I thought I'd stop and take a little shot of it. This is just a minor part of Rocky Trail that they told me was all nice and leveled and smooth. It's not. And this is this is not the steep part. When I get to the steep part, I'm probably going to walk it. Anyway, it is pretty here. But look at all that flat ground on the other side. Wish we were over there riding instead in this damn rocky mountain. But that looks like it might be private property. I see a barn and cattle and stuff over there. Just another stop along the trail. Kind of a pretty shot of the river. And a tired dog. He'll be glad when we get home, I think. I think he's having a good day.